Beautiful. Alright. Beautiful. Okay, so now we've fixed that. The door through here should be unlocked now. We're gonna encounter more shitheads in here. That was probably a waste of mech kit. I only healed myself for one health. Alright. Yep, more shitheads. What do we got? A teleporter. We sit here, he's gotta get closer to kill me. Alright, where you where you porting to? Right in front of me. You take way too much to kill for a shotgun to really be effective against you. Alright. Now I guess we raise lift. I want to know why that guy is apparently evil now. That doesn't seem right. I thought he was a good guy. And the scientist was evil? Unless this is like a... We've got to save our business sort of thing. Like... We can't let the UAC be seen as these guys who happen to have tapped into hell. You know, that would be bad for business. You know, we're, we're developing military technology. Who, who would want to open a portal to hell? Alright. Shit's gonna go down. Uh, I'm not sure where we were meant to be going. Obviously, we're going the right way, though. Oh, God. Come on, bring out the right gun. Got chill. This gun is amazing against the heads. Still not sure what would be most effective against the teleporters, though. Nothing's spawning behind us yet. Alright. And now we can go through here. Always quick save. Oh, hello. I was lucky enough that I was able to swap just in time. Fuck off, mate. Yeah, shotgun definitely not effective against them. Next time I'll try the assault rifle. That didn't work. Hey, I got him. Maybe they're not teleporters. Maybe they just turn invisible. Oh. Boom. Oh, you got... You, you gave me a haircut, mate. That was a haircut. Thank you. That, that almost flew over my head. I should have just crouched. See? Uh-oh. That was like multiple things at once. There he is. I knew there had to be another one. You don't hear multiple growls like that. With no payoff. Oh, hello. Hello over there. <laughs> oh. No jump scares for me, mate. Okay, we didn't actually activate that. That's good. I was worried we activated the barrel. Alright, you're gonna come at me? Bam! You best come at me strong! We could just hide under there until help arrives. Oh, something's gonna happen here. Wow, we haven't seen a zombie in a while. That's almost a welcome break. This looks like platforming. Restart, replace, shut down, but we can't actually activate it. Maybe it malfunctions in a minute. By the way, there's a barrel here and I'm not... <laughs> Have a lie down, mate. We'll remember that there's a med kit right there because I have a really strong feeling that we'll be coming back here. I hope I didn't just waste that barrel. Because if I'm right and we are coming back here, which this many explosive barrels. This seems real. Oh god! Did not see you in the dark, mate. 
you'd think in a proper workplace they would actually organise the barrel spin. Where did you come from? There was like nowhere for you to be. Oh, piece of shit. Nope. Yeah, that's right. Oh, look at you. Look at you. Just fucking ugly imp, mate. No one cares. Ugly imp that took three shotgun shots. Irritating me. More imp. I think I wasted all his barrels. Probably like a boss fight I could have circumvented just by shooting him or something. Okay, enter access code. 931913. Let's just quickly. I mean, maybe it's another PDA, but I remember Michael Abrams, I think it was. Um, yeah. And, uh, instead of an O, he replaced it with a 3. But I can't remember. So it was like 936, 931. Plasma storage. Wait, what did she say the code was? No, she said that was in the storage lock. I'm, I'm overthinking this. We'll come back if we can find the PDA that will obviously have the settings. Oh, good cutscene. Hey, over here. Hello, my over friend. Here. Shadowing. I knew he was gonna die. Why are they acting like that was like this new big bad? Oh, hello. That's exactly what we wanted. Steve Hammer. Best last name. Alright, Steve Hammer. Let's check your user emails. More on Swenson. I'm still shaking from that incident with Swenson. When I close my eyes, I still see that look on his face. The instant between the impact of the plasma and where his hand turned to blue vapor. I don't think I'll ever be able to sleep again. I never liked him. I don't know who was crazy enough to give him a plasma gun, but no one should go that way. Worst of it is, blah, blah, blah. Um, we should lock up the ammo in the storage lockers. You pick the code. Who did he email it to? Matthew Morton. Uh, let's help this poor girl. Uh, this isn't a chain letter, but a choice for all of us to save a little girl is going to die. Uh, whatever. Chain mails. Alright. Steve Hammer, service technician. Since Private Swenson wigged out, shot up that drink machine, then lit himself up with a plasma gun, we've all been a bit nervous. All of us in maintenance knew he was losing it. Finally, when that darn drink machine wouldn't accept his credit, it was exactly the voice I pictured for him. Up and down. You had to laugh when that machine lit up, but before any of us could react, he fed himself enough plasma to power an office building. <laughs> there wasn't enough head to clean up, just vapor. It's Aww. a bad thing to happen to anyone. What a way to anyway, go. Anyway, I know with all the psych problems we've had lately, we need the additional security, but when the guards start going nuts. I don't know, all this extra weapons and ammunition. I mean, do we really need so much firepower laying around? Well, yes. a couple of us decided to lock up all of the unsecured plasma rounds we could find. The code is 734. I think we'll all sleep a bit better tonight knowing it's locked up. Hey, look. So, yeah, that was exactly the voice I pictured for him. It, I like that they're worried about ammo and shit lying around. I mean, it's perfect for us that it's lying around because it means in the event of a demon apocalypse, we're equipped. But if it's an impromptu storage, why does the place clearly say plasma storage on the front? You know, that's that requires forethought. All right. Anyway, we got shit tons of this ammo now. What's coming at us? What is coming at us? 
All right, you. I'm pretty sure there's more than one of you, though. Okay. We're a bit secure. This is cool. We're getting closer. Closer to probably one of the best parts of the game. If memory serves correctly, anyway. All right, cycle airlock. Sweet. Progress. Uh, we are exiting the NPRO facility and ending up at COM transfer. We'll switch to our plasma rifle. Just so we're equipped when it loads. Alright. Click to Do I want to cycle the airlock? Yes. Alright. What the shit are you, mate? Whole new enemies. Like, they're just throwing them at me. I think you're the only one, though, aren't you? Cool, we'll take the air canister. But now I know we got to be careful in here. I thought we'd be safe, you know? But apparently, demons don't need air. Who would have fucking thought? I think that's everything. We don't need ammo or armor, and it, or health and armor, I should say. We can always use ammo. Doesn't look like there's any secrets when it comes to that. I'm thinking maybe those were the replica of that one-eyed big red thing from the original games. I'm not sure. But that's the only thing I can think of that was like a floater. Hey mate, how do you cope against plasma? Apparently pretty freaking well. So plasma's ineffective against you as well. Chain guns, chain guns against you guys all the way. Oh. Uh, you attempting, attempting the survival horrors. Not on my watch. Okay, what's... what's coming at us? Oh god! This is not going as... as hoped. Not at all. Lights went red there and I wasn't... Okay. Chain gun time. Yeah, choose them. Choose through them. You're what I had for breakfast. Alright, you're definitely not coming back. Neither are you. I'm getting less. Alright, now we're getting to demonic chanting. Come at me. Cool and bam. I'm, at, oh, I'm still doing the physical dodging thing. I need to stop that. Alright, can I open door? Totes taking the med kit, bro. Alright. Ah. Oh. Trying the jump scares. Trying to be all spooky and it ain't working. Not on, not this time. Make sure everything's reloaded before we push forward. <laughs> Are you alive? Nope. I'll take your shotgun though, quite happily. They're really trying to startle you. Ain't working in the butt. Not the butt, the butt's a one hit kill, cool. Alright, what do we got here? Surface access. I guess we drop down. Alright. We know the assault rifle's best against you guys. 
And you got a weapon that you come from. Oh god! Shit, man. Way to startle me. Okay. Nothing creeping up behind us. This is cool. I like that we're actually on Mars a bit more. Oh, you think you're going to overwhelm me with numbers? This ain't a numbers game, mate. Let's not jump in the abyss. Let's uh, call the lift. Shit. We've run out of oxygen. Have you got any more? Oh, come on, come on. Race lift. Uh, I'm choking. Okay, I'm alive. Yeah, it's a knockout. Yep, in who thought that there would be a attempt at a scare? Who'd have thought? It's getting very predictable now. But I mean That'll all change very soon. You gonna come down? Let's give you a second to think about it. Not coming down? No, you're gonna stay up there. Like the imps of old. I just can't seem to hit you, so. Oh. Gotcha. Alright, cool. Whoa. 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 This is the new guy. Alright, where are you? He shoots a massive thing, like, what even is that attack? Doesn't matter, he's dead now. Alright, cool. Chain gun. Your long range shotgun's no match for me, mate. 